The Windrose R700 EV isn't out to impress, it's out to deliver. Built in China and hitting global roads in 2026, this electric semi targets long-haul freight with serious numbers. Starting at $250,000 US dollars, or around €227,500, it's aimed squarely at heavy-duty fleets that want diesel level range without the diesel. Underneath, you've got a 729 kilowatt hour lithium iron phosphate battery sitting on an 800 volt system. Fully loaded, the R700 covers up to 416 miles or roughly 670 kilometers on a single charge. Need a boost? Megawatt charging brings back 249 miles, about 400 kilometers in just 35 minutes using CCS1 or MCS ports. Power? This rig's got muscle. 1,040 horsepower, or 775 kilowatts, backed by 2,200 newton meters of torque. That's over 108,000 pounds, or 49,000 kilograms, of gross weight moving on rear-wheel drive. Top speed is 68 miles per hour, or 110 kilometers per hour, ideal for highway cruising. It's built to withstand temperatures from minus 22 to 118 degrees Fahrenheit. Windrose didn't load the cabin with flash. What you get is a smart, functional driver space with a digital dash for route planning, diagnostics, and real-time fleet tools. No gimmicks, just tools to keep the rig rolling. It's already prepped for autonomous driving with LiDAR, radar, and cameras on board, setting the stage for future level four capability. The aerodynamic cab, designed with help from Hygerbus and Jack C, scores a drag coefficient of 0.2755. That's slick for a Class 8 truck and translates to better energy use and operating savings. Configurations include 6x4, 4x2, and soon a 6x2 option. Though not yet certified for American or European highways, Windrose plans homologation and localized assembly by launch. With production starting at 40 units, it's a focused rollout with clear intentions. Real routes, real loads, real electrification. If you're hauling long, heavy, and often, the R700 EV gives you range, torque, and uptime without the diesel price tag at the pump.